So perfect blue skies, almost no wind, beautiful sunshine. These are indeed conditions for the beautiful game. The backdrop here, picturesque, idyllic. No doubt one of the best days of the footballing calendar and it has added to a really jovial, happy mood in the stands, helping to raise the level of sound by more than a few decibels. Shirt sleeve order, very much the dress code. And this must be amongst the favoured arenas of supporters all over the world. It really does have a very special feel to it. This is the perfect game for all parties, not least the neutrals who've just come to enjoy it. Yes, Peter, it's a shame it's only a, a friendly, but then again, that may help us see a more expressive attacking contest. And I'd be prepared to settle for a, a clash of, of lesser intensity in favour of, of lots of flair, skill and plenty of tricks and a few goals. I suspect I've probably overstretched my, my level of greed here. the whistle so Jim tell me this who are you looking for in particular here yeah Samuel Umtiti he's a very fine defender of course but it's what he contributes offensively that I find very impressive Peter when he plays in his favorite left center back position he's able to use the fact that he's left footed to step away from the press and just stride up field lifting the tempo and getting his team moving I wonder whether that has anything to do with you being a defender once upon a time, Jim. From TT. And it's Griezmann. Now it's Messi. Messi. Griezmann. Jordi Alba. From TT. And here's Dembele. Oh, that's nice. Barcelona are experts at this stylish possession-based game. Well, we're talking... Hits one! Oh, surely that deserved better. That was created because of good, lively movement, which pretty much dictated the pass. And the count... It's Dembele! He's done ever so well. Dembele really must have felt he had the measure of the keeper then, but how wrong he was. It's broken loose. Dybala drives it forward. Driving on now, what can they conjure from here? Cristiano Ronaldo. Cristiano Ronaldo! Played forward. Played out to the right. It is deadlocked. Doesn't get the pass he's looking for. Dybala. Danilo. Ronaldo has been found. Umtiti. Did really well to intervene and dispel the growing danger. And it's Griezmann. 
Messi plays it out to the wing. And here's Jordi Alba. Could be thinking about a shot here. And he's cut it out. Danilo goes looking. Cristiano Ronaldo. Hoists it forward. Got a sight of goal. Goes for goal! Goal! Juventus! Oh, he was never going to miss from there. So much to aim at. I just think it's clever positioning from clever movement. And when all of that is synchronised with the right pass, that's what happens. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Yeah, and they know there's plenty of work left in this one, Peter, before they can actually say that the job is over. Jordi Alba to play it forward. He's got options out wide. Now it's Griezmann. Deflected behind for a corner kick. Ricardo displaying his defensive capabilities there. That's no striker's tackle. I think it's great to see that kind of application and desire from a forward who wants to help out his defence. I, I think, you know, any good team, really, your striker should be the first line of that defence, and, and he's delivering. Oh, no question, that's a foul. Griezmann really was well marshalled there because he was denied the opportunity to, to turn. Messi, it's Dembele. Forward it goes. And here's Messi. Dembele. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. Chiesa. Titi does well there. Alert. And that'll be the last act of the first half. And there we are. Off they go for half time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half. But there has only been that one goal, which is very, very tight. First half thoughts? Yes, they're behind, but it's a, a reversible situation. As long as better defensive focus can, can avoid a second goal on the counter, they know they have the wherewithal to come up with what they need. Juventus head for the dressing room in possession of a 1-0 lead. And the game has already resumed here. Juventus carrying a one-goal lead. Tries to get it forward quickly. Dybala. Rabiot. Hoists it high. And it's hoisted clear. Tried to play it through. The movement was good, but the pass lacked authority. Uh, a cause of mild frustration. Jordi Alba. And it's Pjanic. Messi. And Messi! Oh, fine stop from the keeper. Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class wage. Pjanic. Juventus are ahead here by what is still the only goal. Oh, he's got a crucial block in there. And here's Griezmann. Now Messi! And he comes up trumps again. 
Well, look, believe me when I tell you that goalkeepers work harder than anyone else in training, and that's why, to be top class on match day, that was a majestic stop. And shoots! Hoists it forward. Shapes to shoot! Really well taken goal! Well, we're all back to square one, but I hope this game opens up from here. It looks as if it could happen. He was so alert to the possibilities there. Great stuff. Oh, look, there's only one player who merits all the praise for that. Not only did he finish it, but his instincts for being where he was are absolutely top-notch. Barcelona grab the equaliser and we're all square. Yeah, it's a very good contest with two very good sides and with such great individual talent on show, it could go either way. Griezmann. Griezmann. Now it's Messi. It's the And it's Pjanic. Whistle's gone, that's a uh, foul. Messi! And Szczesny pulls off a sensational save! Barcelona with another corner. Dybala goes looking. And here's Messi. He's away. Dybala drives it forward. Cristiano Ronaldo. Jordi Alba. And it's played forward. Jordi Alba gets the better of his man. Forward it goes. Chiesa gets away from his opponent. And he just whacks it away. Oh, that is asking for trouble. Oh, he's found him in space. Meets it first time. And somehow he managed to miss it. Well, he could be headed for a scenario in which Next goal is the winner. That chance could have been it too. Just brushed off the ball there. Chiesa looking to get on the end of this. That will be a corner. <laughs> Barcelona have turned to their bench and we're going to have a substitution. So we have a double substitution going on here. Juventus showing a good level of intensity at this stage. They're calling on all their resources now. Roberto plays it forward. He's played him through. Concentration levels are very good, and so is the commitment. This game could yet yield a winner. Plays a clever pass. Well, both sides might have to settle for a draw here, although there's still a chance for one last fling. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. You wonder if that's it now, but there may be one more opportunity, Peter, for a late, late steal here.
the keeper deserves some sympathy there. He may not have seen that until too late. Juventus take what looks to be a decisive lead. There's still a bit left in it, Peter, but they should find the necessary to avoid a slip-up now. And back to base. Ted. And that's it. Juventus winners by the odd goal. It really could have gone either way, but a win is a win. Juventus leave it late, but in the end, it was great. Well, this looked like it had a, a draw written all over it, Peter, so credit where it's due. They found a way to win it, and they can take great satisfaction from uh, never losing that focus.